Anyway, I, I realize that uh, uh, Chuck won't see this because he's out there in the field. Uh, he's likely right about here, uh, if he were to see this. But um, anyway, the rock is, uh, is more interesting than people think because, first of all, a lot of people are waiting to see close-ups of that rock that has the symbols on it, which I, I believe are erosional. Sandstone and limestone does get funny features like perfect squares and uh, things like that. Uh, really, Robin went up there, but he didn't, he didn't film a while. He didn't know years later uh, people would spot the symbols on the rock, so he turned back at the rock. Okay, now, as far as uh, when you did your video, uh, you were kind of waving the camera around because you were telling where you were going to go, and I just want to emphasize that if you do want to go up that wash, if you do, that the reference is this island. Um, uh, Warlike Wrath call it a rock wall, but actually it's a mountaintop island, and so the alluvium that is washed down could be considered water, and this is an island sticking up above the water just like Hawaii. This is this. That's what that is. And so, uh, I know you know where you're going, but the reference really is this. And then, you, you go up the, uh, this wash here, and obviously you're not going to go off over there. You're going you're gonna to go up, and then you're going you're gonna to see that you're looking up. At, uh, you're going out of the middle of nowhere, and then you go to the right. It forces you into the right, just like it did with really Robin. And, um, and then you go up, you go up, and then here again you see the situation. I don't want to go there. So it forces you to the right, and you, you go up and up, and there's the rock. There's, there's the, literally, literally exactly where the rock is. Uh, another, as far as beach, another interesting thing about it is that I'm a strong proponent as a hiker that if a hiker goes missing, they likely were going to points of interest where a person will go if you were out there hiking if a person was out there hiking. And so this is a ravine of interest, very, very strong ravine of interest. Do I think he's up there? No. Uh, because as he come back, like if he did an M cave route and come back this way, he could still be fresh. You can do that entire hike with one bottle of water. Uh, he, he could have still been fresh and goes, it's too cold. I'm going to head back and then he sees this ravine of interest and goes up there. And, and goes up there. Uh, the other thing is that the top is right here. And so a person can easily go up and stroll back down and there you are at Agave Pit 1. Uh, oh, there's the Joe May Guzzler. I thought the Guzzler would be over here. Uh, Agave Pit 1 is, you know, like a mile and a half, two miles up. Uh, but uh, in other words, once a person goes up there, they can easily just stroll on down and then just, and just loop back. And Kenny Veach also would have known that. He also would have known that. Also, a person would get unusual views of uh, uh, Kenny Veach Canyon, formerly known as uh, Joe May Canyon or Wash. But the, the guzzler is right here. Yeah, I didn't know that. Yeah. Uh, guzzlers are where they they take um, they channel where water comes dripping out in the bottom of canyons and channel it over into uh, like cattle things stuff like that that's what a guzzler is uh, but anyway no this this ravine is of far more interest than uh, people apparently think it is um, especially going by the rule that uh, if I, anyone, Kenny Veach, anybody, goes, goes up here, goes over here, goes up there, well, this looks interesting, I'll go do it. Well, also, he would have done it. He would have done it. And so this, this, uh, this wash, you know, is major, major interest. And also the thing is that Rath did a very good video on it, and they're wondering what that goddamn rock uh, looks like if pictures were took up close. 
So if you don't make it up there, I will. I'll go up. It doesn't matter to me. I'm not saying go do it. But if, like within a week, if nobody else goes up there, I will.